If you're working on a busy mix and the vocals are getting lost, or maybe you're looking for ways to give vocals more presence in the stereo field, I'm gonna show you a few techniques for getting wider vocals. And we'll touch on a few ways to thicken and spread things out. And using a single vocal going right up the center in mono. I don't regret mistakes or the consequences. They don't understand it. They just want confessions. Strip me from my title, that's a major blessing. Cause now riding undercover is my biggest weapon. Then we'll turn it into this. I don't regret mistakes or the consequences. They don't understand it. They just want confessions. Strip me from my title, that's a major blessing. Cause now riding undercover is my biggest weapon. Major damage, locked and loaded. They start to panic, but they're standing frozen. Ground is shaking. So using just one take, we spread it out, thickened it up, gave it depth, and even made it sound like multiple people. Let's go ahead and jump right into this. But before we get started, make sure you take a second to hit subscribe to keep up with all the latest news, tips, tricks, and more from Waves Audio. Now this is the real way of doing it, which is to have the artist or MC do another take, which is the ideal situation. But maybe you have only one take to work with, so try this out. This is the real ADT plugin, the first plugin to emulate the artificial double tracking process designed in 1966 by engineer Ken Townsend at Abbey Road Studios. It gives you the sound of two vocal takes when you have only one. So here's that single dry mono take going right up the center. They like to judge me before they get to know me. But while you're joking, I was getting me some money flying across the country. And now with the plug-in on. They like to judge me before they get to know me. But while you're joking, I was getting me some money flying across the country. And that's just default mode. Instantly wider and thicker. You get an instant copy with a little bit of tape saturation and that signature effect of tracking into two tape machines with the movement and the modulation created by the VeriSpeed oscillator. They like to judge me before they get to know me. But while you're joking, I was getting me some money flying across the country. Now they're flying for me. Broke a record back in Dony, that's a different story. You can adjust the LFO rate and the shape down here. They like to judge me before they get to know me. But while you're joking, I was getting me some money flying across the country. Now they're flying for me. Broke a record back in Dony, that's a different story. I don't regret mistakes. Or the consequences, they don't understand it. They just want confessions. So you can go subtle with this or create all types of trippy phasing and flanging effects. You also control the amount of saturation on the drive. They like to judge me before they get to know me. But while you're joking, I was getting me some money. Flying across the country, now they're flying for me. Broke a record back in Dony, that's a different story. You tailor the width on the replica and the source with the pan controls. They like to judge me before they get to know me. But while you're joking, I was getting me some money. Flying across the country, now they're flying for me. Broke a record back in Dony, that's a different story. I don't regret mistakes or the consequences. Now let's say you don't want the double tracking effect on the vocal throughout the entire track. It might get a little boring if you just leave it on the whole time. So one trick I like to do is I'll start the song with the lead in mono, you know, to draw the listener in, and then I'll automate Real ADT only at certain moments in and out. They like to judge me before they get to know me. But while you're joking, I was getting me some money. Flying across the country, now they're flying for me. Broke a record back in Dony, that's a different story. I don't regret mistakes or the consequences. They don't understand it, they just want confessions. Strip me from my title, that's a major blessing. Cause now riding undercover is my biggest weapon. Just automating the mono vocal with the real ADT plugin, treating it like another stack. The trick to pulling up the wideness effect isn't always about multiple takes and layers and stacks upon stacks. Be a little clever with how and when you place things in the stereo field. Even with one mono take, use real ADT at the right times and give that perception of width to keep things interesting. Another way to widen or thicken your vocals out is with a harmonizer. This is Waves Harmony. It's what I like to call the new doubler. Doubler is a great plugin. But Harmony just gives you more in terms of versatility and parameters for each voice, and it's faster and easier to use when you're in the mix or while you're producing. You can add up to eight voices, not that you need to add eight to make things thick. All you need is a few. You just click them in, and you can move them around any way you want. I don't regret mistakes or the consequences. They don't understand it. They just want confessions. Strip me from my title, that's a major blessing. 
You were just the character in the pitch of the voice with the fine tune in the foreman. I don't regret mistakes or the consequences. They don't understand it. They just want confessions. Strip me from my title, that's a major blessing. Could not ride in undercover is my biggest weapon. Major damage. Looked and loaded. You move him left to right to adjust the panning. I don't regret mistakes or the consequences. They don't understand it. They just want confessions. Strip me from my title, that's a major blessing. Could not ride in undercover is my biggest weapon. Major damage. Looked and loaded. So you can go super wide on those if you want. You also adjust the volume by going up and down. I don't regret mistakes or the consequences. They don't understand it. They just want confessions. Strip me from my title, that's a major blessing. It's got a built-in delay and also a filter you can use on each voice. I don't regret mistakes or the consequences. They don't understand it. They just want confessions. Strip me from my title, that's a major blessing. Could not ride in undercover is my biggest weapon. Major damage. Looked and loaded. They start to panic. Now what I'm going to do is create a little excitement during a specific part of the verse, so right here on this part. So I'm going to create a group effect, take this one take, and make it sound like a few different people. So I'm going to jar in a quick on-off automation for the plugin on this part. Now I don't want the voices to sing, but I just want to add a little melodic movement to them as if they were completely different takes just to be completely different from the original. So I'm going to use Harmony's built-in modulator right here. I'm going to switch it to sequence, sync the rate to eight bars. Then we'll drag it onto the pitch of each voice and dial up the modulation all the way to 100. Now I want to give these new vocals that slight pitch variation. So I'm going to just hit flat. And then I'll click on the pitch open up the drop-down menu, scroll down, and select G2. I don't want to go too low on the pitch on this one. G2 works pitch-wise with the track. Major damage, looked and loaded. They start to panic, but they're standing frozen. All right, so now we'll alter the character of the voice with the fine informant controls. Major damage, looked and loaded. They start to panic, but they're standing frozen. Ground is shaking as the doorway opens. These hearts are racing. I'm going to roll off some of the lows with the filter. Major damage. Looked and loaded. They start to panic. All right, so with the sequencer down here, we're just going to write out a little pitch sequence. You can make the voices go down or up in pitch. Major damage. Looked and loaded. They start to panic, but they're standing frozen. Just for example, let's reset it and drag it out to four steps. And then I'm just going to go down a couple semitones on every other step. And now we get this. Major damage. Looked and loaded. So let's do the same setup on this other voice real quick. Except here, I'm going to flatten the pitch on this voice to F2. All right, and then I'm going to create one more third voice. I'm actually going to keep this one up the middle. I'm going to flatten this pitch to C2. I'll take the foreman down a notch, make him sound a little heavier. Let's filter the lows off a little bit. Don't forget to add the modulator to the pitch on the voice. Dial up the modulation. All right, and now we get this. Major damage. Looked and loaded. They start to panic, but they're standing frozen. All right, it's cool. We added a couple stacks with that variation, but there's no action. So one finishing touch will do. I'm just going to take this second modulator with the LFO shape. And with this, I'll first drag it onto the pan of this left voice. Now I want to give it that movement, push it more towards the left. So I'll dial down the modulation. About minus 20 is enough. Now on this right voice, I want it to push more out to the right. So I'm going to dial up the modulation to about plus 20. And this last one, this third one, I want it to creep up in the middle. So I'm going to put the mod on the level instead of the pin. Dial up the modulation. Just going to give it a little bit more than the left and right. Now I'm just going to go down and adjust the phase on the modulator so that the effect grooves better with the track. And now when we play it back with the rest of the beat, we get this. Could not ride in undercover is my biggest weapon. Major damage, looked and loaded. They start to panic, but they're standing frozen. Ground is shaking as the doorway opens. Now we get that movement in the width and thickness. And we made that specific part a lot more exciting. Now that's just one thing you can do with Harmony to widen and thicken things up. This plugin is not just for singing. Definitely try this one in your verses to make things more interesting. 
Now, one more way to add width to your vocals is to add a little depth and dimension with reverb or delay, but we're not gonna wash the vocals out completely in these effects. All you need is enough to feel it. So this is CLA Epic. You're getting four different reverbs and four different delays, each one individually modeled off of Chris Lord Algae's personal favorite hardware reverbs and delay units, eight faders that you can put on your aux or track and easily dial up the perfect depth on anything. First, before we dial up the reverb, let's hear the dry vocal one more time. They like to judge me before they get to know me. But while you're joking, I was getting me some money. Flying across the country, now they're flying for me. So there's a person there, but we need to create a little scene around him, put him in that zone. But we're not going to wash him out, like I said. This plugin makes it super easy to get a nice balance. So I'm going to start by first switching on the room. All right, let's unmute it. And then I'm going to bring the fader all the way down, start the track, and then I'm slowly going to bring the fader up just until we start to hear it sort of kiss the sides a little bit. You don't want to go any higher than that. They like to judge me before they get to know me. But while you're joking, I was getting me some money. Flying across the country, now they're flying for me. Broke a record back in the it's already too That's much. Let's bring it story. down. I don't regret mistakes or the consequences. They don't understand it. They just want confessions. Strip me from my title, that's a major blessing. Can I write in undercover is my biggest weapon. Now, if you listen in solo, there's definitely a verb there. But when you throw it in the mix, it gives the vocals that depth and a little more presence and that slight feeling of being somewhere else. For those moments when the track gets a little more involved, instead of adding more reverb or cranking up the fader, add another flavor. So on this part, I'm going to kick in the plate reverb. And again, we don't need a lot. We just need enough to feel it and create that sense of space. Strip me from my title, that's a major blessing. Can I ride in undercover is my biggest weapon. Major damage, looked and loaded. They start to panic, but they're standing frozen. I'll play it for you one more time, just so you can hear the effect on the vocals by themselves. Cover is my biggest weapon. Major damage, looked and loaded. They start to panic, but they're standing frozen. And now with the beat back in. Cover is my biggest weapon. Major damage, looked and loaded. They start to panic, but they're standing frozen. Ground is shaking as the doorway opens. These hearts are racing, sudden slow motion. All right, in terms of delay now, I'm going to go back to the beginning of the verse, and I want a little slapback echo to kick in, with just a touch. So I'm going to use the tape delay, and this is going to further help create that width, but also bring out a little more vibe and emotion. They like to judge me before they get to know me. But while you're joking, I was getting me some money. Flying across the country, now they're flying for me. Broke a record back in Dolny, that's a different story. I don't regret mistakes or the consequences. They don't understand it. They just want confessions. Strip me from my title, that's a major blessing. Can I ride in undercover is my biggest weapon. The last thing we'll do are some delay throws. Now, this plugin actually makes that fun. On the throw module, you have this trigger function at the top. You want to make sure that that's turned on. I've got my delay throws here synced to a half. Now, as soon as you click on this button right here during the burst and hold it over the words, those are the words that it's going to throw. So I'm going to enable the automation and record these in. And it's going to throw these words in real time as I click it in. Check it out. They like to judge me before they get to know me. Get to know me. While you're joking, I was getting me was some money. Me some money. Flying across the country. Now they're flying for me. Flying for Broke me. a record back in Dolny, that's a different that's story. A different I don't story. regret mistakes or the, or the consequences. They don't understand it. They just want confessions. Just want confessions. Strip me from my title, that's a major blessing. A major blessing. Can I ride in undercover is my biggest, weapon. my biggest weapon. I wrote the delay throws out in real time. They're sitting right where I want them in the mix already. And if I need to, I can go back and edit them. And I didn't have to do anything other than click them in with the mouse on the fly. Well, there you go. Three simple ways to widen the vocals out in your mix. Be sure to head over to waves.com to learn more. But before you head over there, hit that subscribe button. Take a second and hit subscribe to keep up with all the latest news, tips, tricks, and more from Waves Audio. Until next time, thank you for watching.